Welcome to Eat, Pray, Plan. I'm Rebecca. I'm a wife, a homeschool mom to two adventurous boys, and I plan our lives one sticker at a time. In this video, I'm gonna share with you some tips and tricks that have helped me plan a happy life in hopes that they can help you too. So if you wanna see how I do that, come plan with me. Hello, happy Sunday. It is a very, very rainy day here in South Florida. It has been um, a rainy weekend actually because there is a tropical storm in the area. So, um, yep, so it is a day to just stay inside and uh, hang out at home. So I wanted to, um, I wanted to play with my planner a little bit. And we've had the same bedroom set since we got married and now that we're in the new house, we thought that it was a great time to um, upgrade our bedroom. And with Black Friday and all the holiday sales going on, it is a great time. So I am going to share with you today how I use my Project Pages by Infinite Lotus to create a project a project sheet. So this is my project section and I use it to uh, to brainstorm projects that I want to do around the house and I have my reading nook which is coming together a few things changed but this is kind of like the inspiration so then I create like a little inspirational board here and then I also have I need to get I need to start working on the 2020 chapbooks and again some little inspiration family photos I want to have like canvas photos around the house and here's just some layout inspo and this is what it looks like the blank page so it says project name start date end date the budget how much it costs you costs you objectives brainstorm a to-do list and here I use this for the um, for the inspiration uh, board. So the way that I um, organize my projects is I go on Pinterest and on Instagram, and I just print out on you know regular paper, my printer, nothing fancy, just some inspiration of things that I want to have um, in that area or you know to to put in that project. So. Um, I go on Pinterest and then I just print it out and, um, and then I'm also going to use, uh, some of my new, uh, April and arts little, uh, the little journaling kits. So I really, I'm really liking this one. So these are, she, she sells little journaling kits in her Patreon page and I just love the color scheme that she has going on. It's very muted uh, tones, which I love. So I have a few of the kits and you know, I'll, you'll see me using it. I just cut them out and use glue stick. So nothing fancy or too complicated. So there's, you know, I have them in th this box labeled and then I just cut the pieces out and then, um, you can just use them as stickers. So I do love it because <clears throat> they do, she does keep to like the same um, color scheme. So you can you can use them in, um, I mean, you don't have to stick to one kit. You can just use different kits. So I, I really like this. I like this. I might, I'm gonna move this aside. Whoa, I really like this too. See, it's kind of like the same. Um, and I was gravitating towards actually this kit. So I don't know. I'm going to see. Um, it's not going to be a lot of, you know, decor or anything like that just because I'm working with a small, with a small paper, but we will see how it comes together. So I wanted to share my process with you guys. Okay, so uh, let's get started. So what I'm going to do now is... <clears throat> I'm going to cut out these uh, little uh, pictures that I printed out and then I'm going I'm going to see how I'm going to place them on the project page in the back and um, <clears throat> excuse me and then I'm going to go ahead and just uh, fill out this information. Okay, so let's start.
Okay, so here are my pieces, and I know that they are <clears throat> itty bitty. So I hope that you are able to see uh, clearly and the little detail. But if not, I'm gonna I'm gonna take a picture and I'll share it on my Instagram. But these are some of the little inspo pieces that I want for our bedroom. So here is uh, right now we have a cherry brown like wood. Uh, bed I want a white bed and then this is kind of like the color scheme like the inspo uh, grays um, you know just soft tones neutrals and then um, I want to have pictures on canvas on canvas like this so you know pictures of Andres and I and then these are just some little plants that I picked that I like that I liked and I really like this pot because it is two tones and I love them. And this, we are upgrading to a king size bed. So I picked, I, I liked this because it just shows you how um, to kind of set up your pillows. And then I really love this. I keep seeing this all over and I think it's the perfect time to make one. And there's a place here close to where I live that you can make little like wood things there. So this one just says, what a, what a difference a day makes and it's just different dates. So for example, you know, the day we got married, we got engaged, we got married, we had the boys and just really important days for our family. And then this is the uh, duvet cover that I am loving right now. So what I'm gonna go ahead now and do is just put them here and just see how I'm gonna lay them out because, um, there's a lot of them and I do want to include all of them, but I do know that my space is limited and I do want to add a few things from, from the kit. So we shall see how that goes. I'm going to leave this for the other side and just kind of play around with the placement of these, um, of these little, little pictures. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and place these here and then kind of like my color scheme. Okay, and I'm gonna start, I'm gonna start organizing these. So let's see, let's see how this goes.
Well, here it is. This is the final product of my projects inspo page. And I will go ahead and after fill out all the information on this side of the page, but I went ahead and I just, I really love how this turned out. It came, it came together kind of more like an artsy journaling type of page, which I love. And I have been loving using these, uh, the kit by April Ann Arts. I will link all her information below. I found her on Instagram, but she does have a website and a Patreon page, which I signed up for, and that's how I get all these cute little uh, arts, art pieces. Um, if you do liked this video, I know this is a different type of video, but if you enjoyed this video, let me know in the comments below, and I will add more of these type of videos to my rotation. Once again, thank you so much for being here and uh, for hanging out with me this weekend. And I will catch you next weekend for another video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Have a safe weekend, everyone. Bye.